Amanda Turner here along with William Harvey Turner and we're here to give you our synopsis of the Houston Texans Jacksonville Jaguars game. Um, first of all I want to talk about the number of the day and that's 99. That's how many passing yards our quarterback had. 99 yards. Seriously people? Against Jacksonville? 99 yards. Um, that's beyond pathetic. And then our owner proceeded a few weeks ago to refer to him as like he's a rookie. He only played a few years behind one of the greatest football players to ever play the game in Peyton Manning, but he's being referred to as a rookie. Now, I wish he was a rookie like Dak Prescott, who's kicking some serious ass um, with the Dallas Cowboys, and I really hate giving them any props, but please, if we could have a Dak Prescott, beyond all means, let's get him. But the person we've got is a piece of garbage that is way below average. Anybody that's going to pass for 99 yards in, in a, any game is pathetic as a quarterback, and I'm ashamed and embarrassed by that stat. I think our defense played pretty well, and that's all I'm going to say about the Texans game because I'm really tired of the same old, same old, our quarterback. I mean, everybody's like, well, he didn't throw any interceptions. Wow, come on, man. You passed for 99 yards. Anyway, let's talk about some other games. So let's talk about the Pittsburgh Cowboy game. I will say that was a very entertaining game. I hated that the Cowboys won, but let's be honest with ourselves. Um, Dak Prescott and Zeke Elliott are big wows, and both of them should be in the conversation for MVP of the league. That's really painful to say because I hate the Dallas Cowboys, but those two guys are wows. I mean, they really played well. Um some other games that I want to know, the, the Sunday night game, that was a great game. Seahawks against the Patriots, yay. So glad the Seahawks finally beat the Patriots. Can't stand the Patriots. Very glad to see Russell Wilson and company come back and win that game. So that's a, a game that made me happy. Now let's move on to next week's games. Next week, we've got, um, we're playing Monday night against the Raiders. And I'm sorry to say, yeah, I'm a Texans fan, and I love my team. But I really hope that Derek Carr shoves a big fat one down Rick Smith's ass because he's going to kick our ass. Derek Carr and the Raiders are the real deal, and they're playing great football. He's a great quarterback. He's a great leader. Somebody that we should have drafted. I'm going to say it a million times. Rick Smith, you're an idiot. I love Derek Carr. He's a great quarterback. Anyway, um, so next week we will talk about the Raider game. And we'll see what happens. But I'm predicting we're going to lose that game. I'm sorry, Texans fans. But if you really believe that we're going to beat the Raiders, we barely beat Jacksonville. 99 yards. And I'm going to leave you with that stat. 99 yards. Peace out.